Andrew Horton here, digital media producer at servermania.tv, and today I'm going to show you how to change your remote desktop port on most versions of Windows Server. We're going to work with Server 2012 today, so go to the Start button and type in reg, R-E-G, edit, E-D-I-T. Bring up your registry editor, and I think it's helpful to drag the column over to the right a bit and maximize the screen. And you're going to want to go down to H key local machine, go to system, go to current control set, go to control, and we're going to locate terminal server. It's alphabetical order, so this should be relatively easy. And then go to win stations, and then we're going to locate RDP TCP. And in this folder, we're going to look for port number. Double click on port number, change your base and decimal, and your value right now is set at 3389. That's the default port. We're going to use 3388 as example. Click on OK, and close out your registry editor. Now you will have to reboot your server for these changes to take effect. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. Okay, now that your machine has rebooted, we're going to open up Remote Desktop, start, type in Remote Desktop Connection, and we can use localhost colon 3388, and we'll see it connects. Uh, make sure you open your firewall, and um, if you have any hardware firewalls, make sure you allow for this port and any other uh, important security details. If you have any questions about the process, you can feel free to ask our 24-hour support team.